From you wake up every morning You's a winner, yeah What going on guys, it's your girl Razor in the brrrr d d ding And welcome back to another video Well, a vlog Um, I don't know how this vlog is gonna go Maybe I might do a day in my life I don't know yet so let's see how this goes. I just wanted to catch up with you guys a little bit, you know, take you guys along. One of my busy days, today's Monday. Remember I told you guys I wanted to start back running, which I have been doing. <sighs> It's hard, okay? So, I'm just really trying to cut down on my time, and it's been a struggle. I've been road running, and I recently started back running on my treadmill. I'm gonna get better at it, I will. To fit in my running, I go running at 4.30 a.m. in the morning, and I just came back from my 5.30 clients, personal training clients, but I'm about to take a little break. And then do my second workout. I also started my Jan Hit challenge on my page. Where in January, we're going to be doing high intensity exercises. So check those out if you haven't already. My advice, if you have a lot of things going on in the day, do not play with your sleep. Okay, do not play with your rest. There's this narrative where you go sleep late and wake up early. If that works for you, it works. But I don't know how long you can keep that up. But I can't. I have to go sleep within a decent time. So I try to make sure I get everything done before a certain time. Let's say before 8.30 or before 9 o'clock or before 10 or 10.30. I shut off. I shut down. I try to get things done throughout the day. So I try my best not to procrastinate throughout the day because I have a lot of things to do. I just do it, you know. Spend less time on social media, especially if it's not interacting with my audience or posting anything. I mean, I scroll from time to time, but I'm not on social media scrolling for 30 minutes, 45 minutes for an hour or so at a time because we have things to do. So I try my best not to procrastinate and get things done. Let's get inside to do our next workout. <laughs> Today's workout is a full body from the 200 day challenge from Millionaire Hoy's app. I haven't finished it as yet. <laughs> Ooh, if you're wondering what this is or why I'm drinking it, it's basically carbs, liquid carbs to help with fueling or energy because I haven't eaten anything for the morning. My day started at 4.30. I don't like to eat before I work out. I probably could have eaten a banana or something. This works too, you know, because I can get very hungry in the morning, but if I eat, I won't be able to do my exercises effectively because of my schedule. So let me drink this and then get to working out. It doesn't taste bad actually. It gives Gatorade vibe, but a little sweeter. Wait. I struggled through that workout, but nevertheless, it's finished. And now I'm about to shower and make some breakfast. And then start working. We'll talk more about that just now. So we're back to online learning, online teaching. We had a massive spike of the virus recently so we're back to online i'm going to eat my breakfast and prepare for my first class i think i have about three or four classes today i'm not even sure so i'm just trying to get back into the hang of things so in here is celery kale cucumber green apple breakfast depends sometimes i'll have a smoothie sometimes i'll have a, a big meal like this and sometimes it's oats you know can get creative my first class is at 10 35 i have about an hour to get ready but i'm still gonna start working i have to create my google classrooms and set up my classes for my next school on webex so i'm gonna just be here working but i do have a video film that i have to edit but i want to film another video to post that this week so i might start editing that video later today class number one is done class number two after lunch <laughs> I just woke up from a nap, to be honest, y'all. I can't really skip meals because of how busy my schedule is today. My next class is around 1 o'clock. It's 12.30. But yeah, I'm gonna eat this real quick so I can start my class number two. And I'm already out of it. <laughs> I'm tired, but okay, let's get it. I'm drinking some soursop juice. And I'm about to start my next class. I rushed to eat. Oh, I'm on time, I think. So I have three classes today, and I not too long ago finished up my last class. And... <sighs> 
of everything that I do, I give it my all. So energy is usually not there. I mean, I'm okay. The online platform thing is draining. Having so many classes, having to interact with so many students. This job is a lot. I love teaching, don't get me wrong. But sometimes it's a lot and it can be very draining on me, my mind especially. Not so much my body because I'm already an active person, but mostly my mind. So sometimes I just need to shut off. I have a new client this afternoon at 4 30 but before i do that i have to create my classes for my other school tomorrow so most times both schools do things differently so you just have to adjust to each school sometimes <laughs> come my way money anyway just finished up training a new client my 5 30 canceled i still have my 6 30 this afternoon so i'm gonna go home let me show you guys what I'm eating. These are called dums. I don't know if you have them in your country or wherever you are. But some of them can be really sweet or sour. Or a mixture between sweet and sour. I think they're mostly found in Caribbean islands. Yeah, I know that sound though. Money will come my way. Just raid in the tree for a little bit. Hey! <laughs> one of my co-workers. I don't know which one because they drive the same car. These are big and juicy and fat. Just like how I like them. <laughs> Bring it back. So let me show you guys what they look like for real though. You gotta pick the yellow, the really yellow ones. Y'all look at all these dumbs. Look up here. I'm a vibe anyway. We gonna vibe with it. <laughs> Let's vibe our way home. I feel so much better y'all like earlier. I was so tired. To be honest, I did drink some coffee. <laughs> naps? Naps be saving lives, okay? I live off of naps. I be needing it. But my new client was good. He seems very determined. And I'm so happy that I'm getting more male clients. Which is good. The man them trying to stay nice and tight for the girl. Um. <laughs> nice and right. Let's go with that. Okay, the thing with balancing so many jobs is having a cutoff time for each. I have a 95. 95, but it starts 8.30 to 4.30. So I try to cut it off at 4.30. But because I was having technical difficulties earlier to prevent myself from having too many things to do the next day i do have some free time so i'm gonna try to complete what i was supposed to just so that i can have more time tomorrow well free time just so they won't overlap into each other it's all about balance and boundaries mm -hmm. because my laptop it just overheats and shuts off <sighs> It's just a lot right now. So while it's acting right, I'm gonna try to do what I can. Thankfully, I have my iPad so I can teach off of this because it was shutting off a lot during my classes. I just sign on to all my devices just in case that happens. <laughs> You guys, I'm now getting back into the habit of cooking. I don't know what to call it. So it's basically salmon in pizza bread. Packed with protein. Not too heavy for dinner because I'm not a dinner person. I'm usually not as hungry at night. So it has to be something light. But I still want to get in my protein. So this works, you know. Not too heavy. Not too many calories. Nutritious. Having cucumbers, carrots, some green onions. Bye. 